Youngstown City Council members are set to meet tomorrow morning to discuss the latest proposal to provide ambulance service in the city. As First News senior reporter Jerry Ricciuti tells us, word of the new plan comes just weeks before the city's current contract is about to expire. Members of City Council's safety committee were not able to talk at length about it. We have options. Look at the options. See what's best for the city. That's my only concern. But council is expected to meet in special session Friday morning to look over and possibly vote on a nearly $4 million deal with Emergency Medical Transportation, Inc. to provide ambulance service in the city. Youngstown's current contract with AMR Ambulance expires the end of the month, potentially leaving the city without service. Whatever we do, we, we, we need to take a look at what's going to be the most, not most cost effective, but what's going to provide the most protection to the residents. An ordinance prepared for Friday's meeting states the agreement would be for three years with options for two more. Money to pay for it would come from the city's share of American Rescue Plan funds. EMT currently operates in the Salem, Warren and Alliance areas and is being described as one of the largest public ambulance services in all of Ohio. Some on council are saying privately they believe the ARPA funds would be better spent creating a new fire department ambulance service, but not all agree. If we have ambulance service, that's great. That's a possibility. Um, but if we don't have ambulance service, then that would be a horrible idea. If council passes the legislation Friday, the city's board of control will also meet in special session to approve it. Jerry Ricciuti, WKBN 27 First News.